Good morning from Travel Lodge Patio. Let's have a look. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Clouds and sun. By the way, I have to say that bed is one of the most comfortable sleeps I've ever had. <laughs> okay, I'll shower. Next up, Recky Beach and two common electronics. I need to pick up something and possibly rent a bike. Let's go. Oh, I should add, if you missed the room tour from the last bit, shame on you. <laughs> go back and have a look. I'll pin it above. Up to the pool. And there's also this little sitting area. And right next door here, we have the lovely Vicure. A little bit long of a tooth, but still a lovely place. But I just much prefer this rooftop pool. It's a bit of a sea view. <laughs> Good enough. Both the edge and the base are probably two of the best prime positioned, reasonably priced condominiums in Patio. the edge versus the base. Look at the wide open balconies that the base has, and then the edge, I don't know if they have balconies, or if they do, they're covered in. I much prefer the open balconies on the base. But really, sky's the limit. We'll see another condominium project today, probably an absolute beachfront along a mat. Later. Look at the load on that, wow. Delivery man getting it done in Patio. Quick cut through Patty Avenue to Starbucks. DIY, it's like a uh, hardware store meets dollar store. Avenue Mall, still going. Look at the prices too. $1.99 for three bottles of beer. Five bottles, two ninety nine. dollars Proper gym. I don't know how much it is. You can, you can pay for everything. It includes this? Yes. This makes sense. That's going to be replaced by steps. Yes, and this area so, and you can... 1,600 baht a month. Yeah, yeah, 1,000 baht, and you'll need a new and work up. Every conceivable machine, everything you could possibly want. Probably somebody in Patty is going to say, that's expensive. <laughs> they know a cheaper place. If you do, let me know. Boots, of course. Villa Market right here. Patty has everything you could possibly want. Okay, Starbucks, check. Next up, just across from Avenue Mall here. Money cup? TR Taxi Thai. Yes, sir. How much to the airport? How many people, sir? One. One thousand baht, sir. Eating everything highway. Including a tool? Yes, sir. A thousand baht to the airport. Pretty good. So there, you can contact this gentleman. Parchu TR Taxi, huh? Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. The Luck Hotel, all there, 55 baht. Cricket deals everywhere. 650 a night. Select hotel. Just curious now. Let's have a look. Big room. Yeah, big room. 650. Yeah. Wow. Balcony. This is your pool, right? This is like, like hotel swimming pool? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Have TV, fridge. Right. Very clean. Oh, there you go, 650 baht. Nice little pool. And the beach. It's just a block, well, a couple blocks down there. It looks like a nice little pub here, too. It's a sports bar. Roast with all the fixings, 450. Not bad. Oh, it looks fantastic.
I have to say absolutely everything about this place. Service, food, everything. Fantastic. Highly recommend it. Swordsman. And just like that, we're on Beach Road. And the old Mike Shopping Mall is still here. Let's have a look. Pretty much exactly as I remember it from years ago. <laughs> okay, apparently the fitness is open, but you have to take a lift. Coco. Still open and a great view to work out at. So one month, $13.99. Okay, thank you. Coco Fitness, and Mike Shopping Mall, and Pasha's Coffee Cocktail Lounge. Let's carry on to Royal Garden. There's the longest running Coco Bar in Patia, the Tahitian Queen. Still going. And it says, Happy Hour, Foxy Galba, Mike Pang. There you go. Happy Hour, 69 baht, drop, 99. How are you doing? Here we are at the old Royal Garden. Everybody's believe it or not. That's a pretty good deal. Two for one sixty nine. Mix and match between a Whopper Junior and a Ninja Burger, etc. Oh yeah, and Ripley's. I've never gone in here to Ripley's. I wonder what it's like. Looks like there's some interest in it. People queuing up for tickets. Six ninety nine. I like your makeup. Can I take a photo? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and this looks like one of these escape rooms, or what is this? The vault. Oh, it's a laser maze challenge. Hi. Okay. I see. Thank you. You see, even if you have kids or something to do in Patio, water parks and all sorts. I'm sorry to report the food wave is not open. Hopefully it reopens in the future. This used to be a fantastic spot to grab an inexpensive meal. Everything from Indian to Arabic to Chinese to Thai to Mexican to whatever. And come out in the balcony here and enjoy the view and, and an inexpensive meal. Oh, that was Ripley's Believe It or Not. Madame Tussauds and a whole bunch more. Soothing music. <laughs> it's becoming a very big thing here. Soon there's gonna be more butt shops and 7-Elevens. So that's where they get all these uniforms from and see in the bars from out here. There's some poor women in Patia. Now every side alley here is all kinds of fantastic street food. Look at this. Okay, Tukom, right around the corner. So here's Tukom, the big electronic shop in Patia. Let's have a look if it's still going. I'm sure it is. Let's go upstairs. And this looks much the same as I remember as well. Maybe a few vendors, fewer vendors, but lots more shops open at the, the other end here. 800 baht for the Samsung. <laughs> I used to have that phone, I think. Ah, uh, when life was simpler. The phones were actually compact. The only thing you wanted it for was to call somebody or text. Oh, well, there's still a power buy. Better return policy, etc., but more expensive. Still several computer shops on the fourth floor. Between shopping online and recent worldwide events, Tucom has definitely thinned out, but it's still a viable place to come if you need electronics for sure. Right. And looky here, Friendship Supermarket's still going. 
So they've got everything from cheeses to deli to your favorite imports. <laughs> this is the good stuff. This is wall price for Thailand. <laughs> He breed it. I've never heard about it. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Oh, there you go. So I take one and I give you a tip. Okay? Come, cop. Bye bye. Grand Hall, she said. Just up from just the beginning of Soy Bua Cow here. Looks like I miss it. Nothing left of durian. Okay, I've just accidentally found the cheapest beer in town. Beer Chang, 45. <laughs> Unbelievable, in this Grand Hall Market. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. Now we're away. And good day to you.